Hello everybody and welcome to Clear Path Guidance in Tarot. This is your month, monthly love reading for the sign of Gemini. Um, I would like to thank everybody for all of your lovely kind words last month. I saw all of the comments um, regarding my health. I am back to 100%. I am well. I feel good. I sound good. And um, I want to thank everybody for all your subscriptions, comments, likes, all of that. Uh, for anybody who is new to the channel, I am an empath, uh, which means that I can feel other people's feelings. So if, and I really like doing love readings, that is my um, specialty. So, and I also read tarot cards, but reading people is my specialty. If you are in a relationship, you're not sure where it's going, what's going on, you're feeling confused, um, drop me a line. I don't have a website. All I have is an email address and a YouTube channel. My email address will be at the bottom of the video. Just send me an email and I will send you all the information. I will email you whatever it is that you have questions about as far as the pricing is concerned and um, availability and all of that stuff. I am using the Lenormand deck. Whoops. You can see there that is what it looks like. Okay. And um, it's the Gilded Riviere Lenormand by Ciro Marchetti. All right. Okay. So that is the deck that I'm using this month, and I read them in pairs. So the card is read in pairs, and the very first one here that I pulled is the mountain. So here we have the mountain. The mountain usually talks about um, uh, delays problems and um, feeling the weight of the world is on your shoulders and the obstacles aren't always negative and good can come from them um, but it could also talk about love having obstacles um, that need to be resolved or things won't progress so are you in a relationship that you find it's this obstacle that there's obstacles in the way all the time um, when it comes to timing, this also talks about um, uh, things not happening quickly when the mountain appears. So you can work at it, but these obstacles are going to take time for them to get out of the way. You can see here there's cloudiness here and there is clearness. So it seems to me that either you're moving into, like usually you're, you're lead, reading from right from left to right. So perhaps the obstacles are coming and um, it's gonna, there's gonna be some delays coming up in this relationship, okay? Every time I start talking, my dog acts up. <laughs> okay, so when I read this in pairs, I got the garden. So you, when you read the two of them together, it talks about um, a delayed meeting, all right? Um, parties. This card, this card here talks about good times with people uh, that show up in your life are act, and the people that show up in your life are perhaps active and life of the party and someone who is not really it, being in a committed relationship enjoys playing the field. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me. So it could be that Perhaps you might be in a relationship with somebody. These are the obstacles, okay, that they do not want to commit to you. They just want to be the life of the party. They want to have fun. And it might, this, this might be happening here, okay? Um, you want a commitment from them and perhaps they're not going to give it to you. All right. And uh, then next we have the garden and we have the ship. The ship has come up. So this talks about um, uh, perhaps you could be going on a cruise, uh, traveling, perhaps meeting somebody from a long distance relationship because the ship talks about uh, long distance relationships uh, leading to love or someone behind, uh, someone from far away that you're in love with or you're in, really in a relationship with someone from far away. Um, so the ship really does in love signifies a long distance relationship or someone from another country. Um, or perhaps look outside um, of your zip code 
or postal code for love and talks about waiting for someone to come to you. Stop it! My goodness gracious, every time I start he, talking, he does that. So here we are, we have the obstacles. All right, person perhaps not wanting to commit. Obstacles could be that um, this person lives far away in another country, long distance, and uh, you're really not sure where it's going. Okay, um, so this relationship, if you're in one, okay, there could be obstacles here. All right, person doesn't really want to commit. And perhaps if it's a long distance relationship, um, it's not someone that you can kind of keep your eye on, right? So, um, so here we go. All right, or it could be you could be going to travel. All right, and to see this person. In this long distance relationship now these readings are not meant for every Gemini out there okay just so you know so if this reading does not resonate with you all right drop me a line we can set up a private reading and I can send you all of the information okay I will do an energy reading and tarot spread I do not limit time and I don't limit questions okay all right everybody I hope all you Gemini's have a wonderful January. Bye-bye.